it's me, Stone Bean, and welcome back to some more Feed the Beast Revelation. Yes, we are back here on the server, and uh, nobody's around. There's no point in me even saying it. Yeah, no one's on. Um, yeah, it's. I, I, I think. Let's be honest. We're coming to the end of this server, and uh, I'm 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 getting close to finishing as well. Uh, there's there's just a few things that I would like to do. Um, but yeah, guys, if you are still enjoying this series, then please do stomp on that like button for me. Also, if you're new to the channel, then why not subscribe for daily videos? Please do tell all your friends about the channel and do all that wonderful stuff because it really does help out a lot. I can't stress that enough. Right? Um, I am uh, collecting some ender pearls because, well, I need to. I need, I need, well, I don't really need to, but, you know, harvest while I'm there. Uh, I need to check on my pickaxe. This has been running for a good few days, and as you can see, uh, we are collecting all the experiences into these drums, um, and I want to see what level we're at now. So, uh, we are heroic, and uh, we have four modifiers, four modifiers spare on this pickaxe alone. I can, I can add some redstone to this, I think. I can, I'm... Let's do it. Let's add some redstone uh, because that will that will mine faster. Um, th there goes my phone. Um, so yeah, so let's add a little bit of redstone to uh, to this. And I, you know, I say I'm coming to the end of this series. I'm I'm thinking about. It. I'm not quite yet. Uh, I have a long way to go. I I do have a long way to go. I've got. Uh, environmental tech to go. I need to go and do all of the draconic stuff. There's so much to be done. Um, so yeah, so that was a bit of an exaggeration there. There we go. Let's add some redstone to this bad boy. This is going to cut like a hot knife through butter. Uh, so let's, uh, let's keep going. Can we, can we not add any more? Haste Hastista. Haste Uh Modifies. All gone? Are they all gone? Are we, are we, are we there? Are we, uh, let me scroll down here. Uh, can we scroll down? Hey, sister, 198 out of 200. So I need to break some of this down. All right, maybe I was a bit overkill uh, with my with my redstone. Can I can I do that now? Nope. Okay, let's, uh, let's break that redstone down into redstone. Hey, Podge joined the game. See, look, the, the server's not over. That's what I'm talking about. Um, but I do need to say... If you do want to come and join this server, you can. Uh, you, you know, uh, you, you're free to go over to Patreon. Link is in the description down below. And uh, come and join us over here on uh, Feed the Beast Revelation. Uh, let me say hi to Podge. Um, there we go. Hi, Podge. Hey. Um, yeah, and also uh, so, some news uh, on uh, Discord. If you uh, if you come and join the Discord tier, you can join t Discord for free, but if you join the uh, Patreon tier, um, uh, you can come and find out the exciting news uh let's see how quick that goes now yeah i mean it's going faster right but we'll just leave that doing its thing uh keep mining away you guys are are looking good um so let's get you breeding again before you all die like you did last time um yeah anyway so uh yeah if you want to come and join uh patreon then the uh, link is in the description down below and the link for discord uh if you want to come join the free discord then uh, feel free to uh you can come and chat to the guys on there and um yeah It'll be kind of cool. Right, let's get on with uh, what we were doing last episode. So we were doing advanced rocketry. And uh, if you remember, we set up this machine. This was the uh, the uh, uh, something smelter. Arc furnace, that's it. Uh, then we have the saw thingy. And then we have the quartz crucible. No, we have the crystallizer. So let's explain these machines because we didn't really get to last episode. Um, we just sort of made them and wasn't able to use them. So because this thing takes forever. So this thing, you put sand in here, which I have, and then output is silicone ingots. That's what you get from those things, right? So you take your silicone ingots, right? And then you, you take those and, and turn those into silicone nuggets. And then in here, in the input hatch, you put, let's put six for uh, argument's sake. You put, yeah, that'll do, uh, those in there. And, oh, let's, let's throw those in, 13. Let's, let's, let's make that even, like, like, there. There we go. And then this goes through the crystallizer and crystallizes into silicone buels. You then take your silicone buel and you place that in your sawmill, like so. And then these silicone buels get sort of minced up a little bit. And then, as you can see, the cool animation. 
and then in here you get silicone wafers now if I recall correctly I think you put the silicone wafers back through I think you do and that 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 doesn't happen Oh crap! Okay, well, um, <laughs> we need uh, we need a few more machines from this uh, this mod anyway, so um, uh, that is fine. So we've got room here for one more machine, and then we'll we'll add a few more. Uh, do I have? No, I don't. Okay, so let's go and look at the next machine we're going to need. Uh, in actual fact, let's place it down. So the next machine we're going to need is because we've got to start making some rocket fuel. Uh, is da -da 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 -da, we're going to need this today? But the next machine we're going to need is the electrolyzer. There we go. So we're set for the electrolyzer. Uh, if we just click like there, it should tell us. Right, okay, so we need a little bit more space. Let's, um, let's try here. Right, one more back, and then we can get that fitted in beautifully just there. there no, I should, I should, hey, there then. There we go, that's beautiful. So this is the, what's this? Fluid input hatch. That's fine. That's fine. And then we have fluid output hatch. So if we go to this, it will tell us everything we need for the electrolyzer. So let's uh, let's go to our uh, AE system. I should really put a screen down here. It would make life a lot easier so I don't have to keep uh, going all over the place to try and craft. Uh, but uh, what we're going to need is we're going to need one electrolyzer. Electrolyzer. Um now our oh, basic circuit which means we're going to need to put a basic circuit plate which is made in the precision assembler so it is the precision assembler we're going to need to make first uh, so do we have all of these we are close we are close uh, let's make the precision assem assembler assem assembler um, so we need a dropper there we go we'll make a dropper done uh, we need a steel gear. There we go. Done. And then we can do this. Done. Done. That is a precision assembler. And we're going to go and have to place this down. So this is quite a large uh, multi-block machine. So it may be that I'll um, I'll remove what I've got over here and just try and get the assembler in here, perhaps. Uh, so let's do uh, this. And then we're going to need the precision assembling machine. So let's click there. Oh, we are close. We are looking close there. Let's get rid of you done um, let's try it here let's try it here there we go that looks perfect uh, so that's where we're gonna put that okay let's um let's now go over to here and we can go and check what it is that we need so um, <laughs> I've been doing a little bit of research on this one. Uh, so it is the precision assembler, which we have. Uh, we're going to need uh, motor advanced or enhanced. Enhanced motor is what we're after. So can we... Ah, Let's type in motor. How many of these do we need? Um, so two motors. It's the advanced motor that I can make. I know I can make those. One, two. There we go. Done for that uh, then we're going to need um, aluminium coil so because apparently aluminium is better than gold for some reason I don't know why but we'll make uh, that many of those uh, and throw those in there for now oh I needed those tonight that's um two of those I think it was um, we got the motor assembler uh, two coil two glass uh, let's grab two of you. There we go. And let's throw this redstone back in while while we're, while we're here. And and all of these enderpearls. I've got like a full inventory of stuff I don't really actually need. Um, so yeah, yeah that'll do. Uh, so we've got the glass. Uh, then we're going to need machine structure. How many of those? Seven. No. Twenty. And then we're going to need uh, power input. And then an input and output. Okay, so let's do input. There we go. So that means I can... Oh, I'd love to make one of those. Uh, input hatch. There we go. Um, let's do the output hatch. There we go. Done. And then the power input, which we... Oh, are we missing these? Wow. Okay, let's make a whole bunch of this stuff then. 
There we go. I don't mind doing that because, you know, uh, iron for days. There we go. And then uh, do that. Nope. Let's do that. Do that. There we go. Let's make as many of these as we possibly can. Done. There we go. That'll do. And then we can make this. Done. That's the power input. And uh, we're going to need uh, 20 machine structure blocks. So... Uh, 20 of these. We'll just take a stack. There we go. Right, I think... What the... Go away. What's wrong with you, man? Uh, so let's go over to here and... Let's get this uh, precision assembler set up. So I was kind of stood... Like... Here? I think that's right. Yeah, there we go. That's cool. Okay, so let's get this place down then. So we have uh, you and you... And then we've got fluid. We don't need fluid for this machine, I don't believe. I don't think we do. Uh, but we do need the power input. So we can place that just there. Um, and then it obviously wants the precision assembler right on the corner there. So let's do uh, that. And then we'll put the input here. Like so. And the output here. And then we'll just fill it in with machine structures. I seem to remember making this one in Invasion. It was it was a nightmare. Uh, like so, like so. We didn't bring... Oh, yeah, we did. We brought the two aluminium coils. Like so, like so. There we go. That's the base. And then if we shift and scroll up, uh, we can see the next part, which is the two glass. So one there, one there. And then it's machine structures all the way around, I believe. I think that's the only block I have left, so it must be. Uh, the two air obviously being the two on the inside and then the next level is just machine structure blocks okay so let's put all those down i think that is pretty much everything uh we need i've just got to get to the power supply and then i should be able to click on here there we go the precision assembler is assembled um so uh that's just for let's this let's, let's do this this let's break into here and we'll put the power right here because otherwise I, I i won't like the fact that it's hidden uh, not hidden so um where's my blocks there's materian there we go, that's better. So this is all set up now. So what we can do is, uh, if we go over to the saw and grab these silicone wafers, and we'll grab those ones out of there as well because they can't be used, then what we need to do is place these in here, in the input, and switch this bad boy on, and do stuff. Assemble. What's, what's this? What? What's, what's all this? Does it, does it require water? Surely not. Um, give me a second. Okay, so I'm a fool, but it's fine. Um, I, I know what to do. Uh, yeah, I, I didn't read the destructions right. Uh, let's, um, let's grab some redstone. There we go. Let's grab you. Uh, the, the machine works. I, I, I knew I set it up right. I'm, I'm just a derp. It's fine. It's no problem. Uh, so, whoa. Uh, let's go over to here. And if we take, uh, no, wrong place. If we take our silicone wafers, we've got 24. And then we'll, we'll grab, uh, 24 of you. There we go. And then we'll grab uh, 24 of you. Like so. We'll place that in there. That in there. And this thing should start going. There we go. Cool. I did set it up right. I knew I, knew I did. But I wasn't sure. <laughs> um, so yeah. So that's all working now. And then when that goes through. I, I love the animation on this. It's fantastic. When that goes through. In here we should get a, uh, a basic. No not a basic wafer is it. It's a basic circuit I believe. Uh, when it's ready. Are, are you ready? Right, they're going in. They're going out. Basic circuit plate. Then we take the basic circuit plate and we go over to here. We place that inside of here and then that will cut that up and turn it into a circuit for me. Yes, sir. I do know what I'm doing. Honest. Um, so once we've got that, which uh, should come through any moment now, we should get those uh, the little basic circuits, which 
it takes a while, but we've got four. There we go. Um, and now we can head back and uh, start crafting up for the um, the next machine, which I think, uh, after I've put all that around there, I'm not going to have enough room, am I? So I think uh, we'll, we'll have to put it here. Uh, maybe that's uh, uh so it's not the crystallizer we've made this guy it is da -da 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 the electrolyzer uh we need this guy so uh that's um let's do that that's going to show me the electrolyzer uh let's put it there actually yeah and then we'll just kind of hide this this little part here uh this can be where fluid goes in yes uh so that's fluid in that's fluid in Fluid out, fluid out. Oh, mm, yeah, that's going to be a problem. Uh, we'll probably put it there then. So uh, let's head up. Let's go and craft all the stuff for that, and then we can actually get to work on making some rocket fuel. This this is amazing. I, I really can't wait for this. This is going to be fantastic. Uh, so so. Uh, let's see what we need for this. So it is the electrolyzer, electrolyzer, um, plant selector, no, electrolyzer. There we go, we're almost there with that. We just need one of these, done, and one of these, done, and one of these, done. There we go, we've got the electrolyzer. Uh, then we're going to need um, power input plugs, two power input plugs so uh, let's type in plug again and that should uh, allow us to power input power output do we need power input and power output just input only surely uh, so we need some more of these batteries so let's make like a bunch of these there we go done and then make uh, two of those that is that um, then it is how many coils? We need one aluminium coil. Aluminium coil, just one please. There we go, done. And then, uh, what's the next thing? Uh, fluid output hatch, okay. Output. <laughs> uh, so we've got fluid output hatch, which is a bucket in a machine frame. That's, that's rather cheap. And then we're going to need another fluid output hatch, I think it was, because we needed two of those. Then we're going to need one input hatch. Uh, so, uh, input, power input, uh, fl fluid, input hatch. There we go. And that is the bucket the opposite way around. Of course it is. Uh, then we're going to need two machine structures, which we have. Excellent. So... Um, let's head over to here, and, um, uh, I'm, I, uh, yeah, where I've got the machine, that's going to be a problem, because I need to add fluid to it. Uh, can I do it like, mm, can I do it like, like this, maybe? Is that, that's only going to cut off there, isn't it? But then I can have the fluid behind. Yeah, let's do that then. So, uh, we've got machine structure here, uh, let's place that down, then we've got fluid input here, uh, place that bad boy down. Uh, another machine structure just there. It shouldn't affect this machine at all, um, because I've got the input and output hatch, as long as that's turned on, I should be able to access it. Should, is the uh, technical term there. So, let's put the electrolyzer down like so, then we've got the fluid output here. Uh, we have one there and one there and that is that level done. Let's do the next level uh, We're going to need the power power and Iridium or whatever coil we've got. Uh, we need two powers because um, It's going to be converting water into uh, the the things that I need there we go That is that done. So uh, we only have one power output and input, but that's fine. We need a sink uh, then we're going to need a couple of drums, I guess. Yeah, let's make uh, let's make a couple of drums because then that could uh, that that could do some good stuff. So let's see if we got a spare sink. Sink. Uh, let's make one of those then, please. Oh, really? Uh, how do we get terracotta again? I've, I've totally forgot. I think it's a block of clay, right? So give me blocks of clay, please. There we go. And we're going to fire that into the uh, the 
furnace over here. You got room for that? Um, let's swap you out. Thank you. And we'll throw you into there. All of this should have been smelted down by now, but never mind. Um, we were running out of gold anyway. Uh, so uh, we should be able to now make the sink. Uh, there we go. Don't <laughs> I need a bucket of water. Uh, there we go. Let's go and grab a bucket of water. I really need to sort of like just have a sink spare. Uh, where I can uh, get lots of water. Let's grab like two buckets here and then we'll put a sink next to my uh, my grid. Um, yeah, I know auto crafting. Yes, it would be a lot easier, wouldn't it? Uh, let's do that then. Grab you and then let's make another one for whenever I need water in a crafting ingredient. So let's put that there. There we go. Be back later, says Podge. Okay. Uh, D, C, uh... Uh, right, okay, so do, 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 uh, we have a sink. We're going to need a fluid, fluid, fluid duct. What we got? Hardened fluid. I like the hardened fluid duct. They're, they're kind of sexy. Uh, let's grab some servos. Uh, we're going to need some drums. I only got three. I need kind of more than that, but that's fine. Drum, drum. Oh, it's because I'm on here. Okay. Uh, there we go. Oh, we got we got some iron drums. I want the reinforced. Uh, I would like I like a couple of reinforced. Uh, one, two there. Um, I've only got two servos, so let's make a servo. Another one of those. There we go. That should be easy to do. And then let's just grab some more fluid out as well. Uh, we using hard it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just grab it all because. It'll look good. Okay, so let's head over to um, our little hidey hole here. And we should be able to begin uh, producing some rocket fuel. So that's just a tank, I think. I, I'm not sure. That noise you can hear is next door. That's where all my generators are. They're running like crazy. Uh, so if we grab our sink, place that there. Um, grab some hardened fluid duct, and we'll place that like so. That's going to connect to here. And then all we're going to do is we're going to turn that on and that's going to allow water to go into here uh the water then goes into here and as we can see it should uh should already start electrolyzing and then in these two tanks we're going to get hydrogen and oxygen oxygen we will need to breathe hydrogen we will need for rocket fuel um i don't think oxygen will go into a drum come to think of it uh right so that's empty and that's empty. Why are you empty? Because you have no power. Because I didn't make... <laughs> I didn't make the plugs. Okay, let's turn that one on. Uh, let's go and make another plug. I'm sorry, that is a police siren. I have to have my window open. It is the middle of winter, and I am in a small room where the heating is on, and it's very, very hot. Uh, okay, so... Uh, let's type in plug... And see what comes up first. No, I want point. Okay. Uh, P O I N. There we go. Make me one of these, please. Oh, come on. Seriously? Oh, come on, man. See, I should have like a stack of these ready to go at any point. Right. Make those. There we go. There we go. Stack of those ready to go at any point, and then then just make like a stack of that whatever. That'll do. There there is plenty of power there. So if we go and turn this on now, uh, we should be good to go here. I think uh, I think power is not going to be uh, an issue. There we go. Um, there we go. We've got that going, and now we should see we have hydrogen here and oxygen here. Now is oxygen is more of a gas than a fluid, so. If it hooks up, I'll be very surprised. But we shall see. We shall see. Let's let's uh, let's try this. Yeah, the fluid duct connects. So, can we fill this up? Uh, the surveys are here, so let's do that and pull that out. Yeah, that that drum fills with oxygen. I don't even ask. I've no idea. Uh, but let's connect that one up as well. There we go, and turn that on, and then this should fill up with hydrogen. Hydrogen and oxygen and this will just constantly run all day long now because unlimited water source and uh, we should see this yeah look producing beautiful hydrogen and oxygen hydrogen 
will be refined into the rocket fuel oxygen, like I say, uh, we're going to use for the air. Now, is there any other machine uh, that I could make use of? I mean, let's, let's look at a uh, rocket. It's been a while since I made one. So, uh, advanced rocket engine, rocket assembly machine. So, we're going to need titanium. How do we get titanium? So... We can't get titanium. Hmm. Okay. So the rocket assembly machine can't be crafted, surely. Let's, um... Let's look. Let's see. So, rutile and pyrothium dust. Rutile ore. Do we... Do we get rutile ore? I don't... I don't think we have rutile. But I'll, I'll check. Um, I mean, let's, let's be... Let's be sure. Um, to see. Oh, we do, but not a lot. Wow, where do we find this then? So it's high in the overworld, huh? So, is that the only place? It's, it's the overworld? Wow. So it looks like I need to set up. Because Rutile Ore, I, I need, I, I've got to get this. And then we're going to have to start making Pyrophium Dust. So around Y level 47 to 55 is probably the highest concentration. 47 to 55. Yeah. So about, yeah, we'll say 43 to 55. So I can set up, uh, if I grab the rutile ore that I do have, uh, rutile like so and I can set up my current builder which is actually mining uh, this area I can actually set it up so that it will pick up rutile for me as well um, all I need to do is just rerun it on its current sort of yeah let's do this and then we'll do that and then we'll place that into the list and then we'll throw that into there because this will just start filling up with all manner of junk here uh, Come on, man. Seriously? I mean, come on, look. Half a heart of damage. Uh, I will kill you with this. There you go. One, oh, two, three. And you're dead. Um, okay, so this should start picking up Rutile for me. I feel like I might need to uh, set that again. I don't know. Maybe if I pull it out and restart. There you go. Pull it out, restart. There we go. Now you can start from zero and just start pulling out all the rutile ore that you can find. Please? Even my nether quarry is still going. That's amazing. Um, but guys, yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it there for today. Uh, um, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna leave it there for today because I, I want to let that machine run and um, start making a load, of, uh, a load of rocket fuel for us. Also, I'm going to get a load of these... Um, these chips made up. Wow. A lot of power. I'm going to get a load of these chips made up. Um, I may look at upgrading this um, to the next tier, which isn't too much. It's just a bit more redstone. And I think, uh, draconic-wise, we have, we have plenty. We have plenty going. Um, if I look at my uranium situation, uranium... Uh, we have all of this uranium yet. We have all of that uranium yet. And yeah, we're, we're good. We're good for the moment. Um, so yeah, so uh, I, I, I think I, I think draconium we should be okay. Dra yeah, I mean, come on. We're good. We're good. We, we could definitely upgrade to the highest tier we can until we need to go and fight the uh, the Chaos Dragon anyway. Uh, but yeah, guys, uh, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And if you did enjoy them, please do stomp on that like button for me. Also, if you're new to the channel, then why not subscribe for daily videos. Please do tell all your friends about the channel and do all that wonderful stuff. Come join Discord. You can uh, you can come join it for free. And um, uh, if you want to become a Patreon, um, then link is in the description down below. And you'll gain access to this server and any other server we've been in. And uh, you can join in on the secret conversation we've got going on on Discord. But uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I've been Stomp the Bean. This has been Feed the Beast Revelation. And I'll see you in the next episode. Stream.